always try to share with our listeners uh, key topics that are helpful in the workplace and in the uh, business community relating to the workplace. And uh, um, the first topic that I want to share, um, besides um, um, talking to you about the continual trends in Massachusetts and nationally, but Massachusetts, we continue to see a, uh, um, a drop in the unemployment, which is always a good sign. Um, but the major topic is, um, as you know, recently the, uh, the deadline for the Affordable, Hair, um, Affordable Care Act, uh, the signing up for, um, for health insurance, um, has ended. And um, I, I think it's uh, obviously both of us will analyze this in a year because we'll get a chance to see the success of the program. But um, they're already talking about some positives and negatives. Um, one of the positives for President Obama is his original projection of 7 million signing up. And um, although the numbers are not in, it looks like he's going to have those numbers of people that have signed up and, and uh, um, are going on the, have gone on the site and are looking at um, um, making sure that they're um, insured or they'll get the 1% income tax penalty. Um, per month without having health insurance. And one of the things I want to talk about is our lingering questions as we're going to analyze and as people are going to uh, discuss the, um, the benefits or the detriments of Obamacare over the next year. And um, there have been articles um, talking about it, but it was interesting. Already um, a uh, talk show host was talking about um, the deadline was just, just ended and already uh, President Obama is giving an exception, and an exception is uh, hardship. And um, the, uh, the joke everybody's talking about is one of the hardships is, are for people who had trouble signing up for health care insurance, they can use that as, a, um, as an extension of their signing up. So there are still ways that they're leveraging. But um, some of the um, unanswered questions or some questions that people have to analyze, and this has been talk about um, on Bloomberg and Business Week are um, um, how many um, didn't have insurance before? What, are, what, um, what does this coverage? So was this um, um, a, uh, a positive in terms of bringing new people in or is this just um, something that would have happened anyway? And um, so far the results talk about um, only about a third um, um, people that, um, excuse me, a quarter of the people that are getting coverage. Three quarter, quarters of the people, I can't even talk this morning, three quarters of the people um, had some form of health insurance before. 